Hey guys, Ed here. Today we have this Nissan Maxima. In this quick video, I'd like to show you how to replace your battery in this car. So let's start. First thing we're gonna do, we're gonna pop the hood. Pull the latch. Find the other latch, move it to the left. And raise the hood up, it should stay. For this procedure, we will need a 10 millimeter socket, like this. Okay, and what we're gonna do, uh, first of all, we're gonna remove terminals. Okay, so uh, remove uh, first we're gonna remove the negative terminal, then we're gonna remove the positive terminal. So how we do this? Do this. Just take and loosen up this nut. Don't take it off. Just loosen it up so you can take the terminal off. Same thing here. Okay, so let's do this. All right, let's start. Loosen this up. Take it off and this one. Okay. Just put it aside for now so it's not touching. Um, so next thing we're gonna take out this uh, bolt. Okay, same same ten millimeter. Take this bolt out. And after that, we're gonna, uh, there are nuts, this nut right here, and this nut right here. So we're gonna take them out, okay? So let's do this. I'm taking the bolt out first. Next thing, we're gonna take out nuts. Take nuts, take this. Don't drop them there because you, you won't be able to find them after this. Okay, now we can just remove, just move this aside if it's on your way. Now take the bracket and just take it off and put it here. Don't lose these things, okay, let them be on the side. All right, at this point we can actually just grab the battery and take it out. That's what we're gonna do now. So grab it on the sides and pull it out. Okay, so here we have the battery, it, it has this cover here, I think it's ripped off already, but okay, it is what it is. Now, uh, so here's our battery, in case if you have to change one, you just go to parts store or eBay or just order it online. Uh, keep in mind that uh, positive is on left top side. Uh, okay, so and the, if you buy a parts store you can take your old battery in uh, and uh, they're gonna give you some discount on new battery so keep that in mind okay once you have the new battery in same thing we're just gonna take this pull it around and wiggle it back in place clear st stuff up here so nothing is on your way and put the battery back in again uh, make sure that the Negative is right here on the bottom, okay, and the positive was over there.
Okay, so we have the battery in. What we can do, we can try terminals on. See if... Okay, yeah, we, we can get them on. No problem. Good. Now... Okay, so now it's gonna be it's gonna be the same reverse procedure. We're gonna put the bracket on. Put this thing here. This goes in here. Okay, don't overdo your battery when you're gonna tighten up. Don't do it because uh, somebody who put the battery in first, they already de deformed the body of this battery. So just just as you don't need it to move. Okay, just don't don't overdo it. So have the bracket on, and let's redo screws. The one, the screw goes here, and two nuts on top of here. Okay, once we have this screw in, the bolt in, uh, nuts on, uh, it's time to put our bad terminals back on. So positive. Okay, so have it on. Negative. Put it on. And now what we have to do is just tighten up this nut here and this nut right here and you're gonna be all set uh, guys keep in mind that uh, your radio stations and the uh, trip odometer and some stuff could reset so that's normal okay hope this helps if it does please press like button and have a great day bye bye